Alright, we're going to take this carburetor off and take it apart. On this model here, first thing you got to do is get this out of the way. I have used uh, channel locks, locking pliers, strap wrench. May need a you may need a new one after this. Nah. Now we want to remove the fuel line. You'll have some fuel leakage. Now the first time I pulled this off, I seen trash hanging out the line. Which means this right here, I'll never buy another and I'll buy one better than that. Now we want to remove this screw right here. And top one on here. That's a little O-ring here. That is in bad shape. Get the other side out. This happens to be loose. We'll just set that over here. And lean your carburetor up like that and take it off the linkage. All right, now we can go in here. What you can do here is you run this in, get a screwdriver, and you mark right here with something, or on the screwdriver, and you run it in as far as it'll go and count how many turns it is. And that way you'll know if you remove this from here. Do the same thing here with that. Run it in, and then count, and then run it back out, and you'll be somewhere in the ballpark. Now we want to remove the jet. Now you can uh, put cleaner in here, all kinds of things to try to get this jet out, but this is really something else. So what I do, This will get so hot that you can't hold it. And put you on a welding glove. And then just put that down in there in the slot. and give this everything you got once I can find it in there. Now what I've done to make this screwdriver right here, I have run over here and done this on the grinder and cut off the large part. Took off the high side. Four, 
fit down in there. And then I took it in here to the one by 42. And I just take off the sharp edges on each corner. And then I touch it right here, make it a little thicker. A little thicker than what it is. I'm going to take all these out. i got three of them. Take our bowl out. If it'll cooperate. We got the floating needle out. A lot of times uh, this will tear all the pieces. If you want to take it off or not, I did and had to buy a new gasket. Now since these only bolt down with three bolts, these is notorious for uh, leaking and uh, sucking in air. So what we're going to do is we're going to go set up some sandpaper and just sand this a little bit this is the flattest surface i got this is a machinist layout table that's seen its better days we lay that down on there this is 220 grit and we'll get that down till it shines Okay, that's good enough. What I'm going to do is I'm going to soak this in carburetor cleaner overnight and do a little extra cleaning on it. This thing is just not going to be deep enough for all our parts. So what I'll do is hang a wire on here and put that in there. Well, let's see what we can do about all of that in there. Yeah, let's cut us a little stick about this long. going to take some of these I'm going to roll that thing up on here about like that
what I'm going to do is uh, heat that up for a few seconds. And I'm going to take these screws out of this butterfly. the uh, bead blaster around in there it's just not clean enough that is as clean as we're going to get it now we want to put our shaft back in this goes over here like this these two goes right on there like that Washed it all, flowed it out. Now this is a tricky part. Get that in there like that. This goes in there first. Get a screwdriver with a uh, magnetic end. to assemble this back together. I'm gonna put that right on there. Like that. The needle in. Mm -hmm. Like that. This right here goes right here. back in her. Get them all started and we go back and we tighten them a little bit at a time. Get our idle needle back in. And then our long jet, I call this the power valve. 
this right here you got to make sure all these little holes right here is clean you have to stick a wire in it whatever and blow it out real good and test it now we get our specialty made screwdriver and this goes way down in there Here that's seated. Now we can get our little fella back in here. Okay. There she be. Better fuel. 